this purse. This razorless shave cream. <laughs> Trying to get ready for a birthday party. It's a Nigerian birthday party, and honestly, Nigerian parties they go all out. Doesn't matter if it's a big party, a small party, they go all out. So I'm trying to get my skincare done because my face is it's been feeling really dry since I shaved it. So I'm gonna go ahead and use a shake mask and um I have two outfits in mind I want to wear. But uh, I I'm gonna show you guys. Oh, I feel so good. I have two options. I have this one. It's like a really long armless dress. I feel like it's too long. I don't want to wear this to a birthday party. I feel like it's kind of like a dinner vibe or something. But I'm not gonna go with this one. I think I'm gonna go with the other one. That's the other one. It's just a simple black dress. It's an halter deck dress. And there's a sleeve on the side of right there. So I think I'm gonna go with this one. It has like sleeves. It's cold right now, but I'm gonna wear a jacket and I have to shave my leg for this. I think it's gonna be cute. I like this. My sister actually got me this dress. It's gonna be like that. So imagine the dress on. I'm gonna do a, some cluster lashes. I've been really loving cluster lashes, honestly, because I can wear them for a few days. I don't wear them more than like four days max and I take them out because I can't really wash my waterline that good. So. I just like to take it for four days max and then I'll take them off. Oh yeah, and I found my eye cream. It was in my sister's room. Hopefully my dark circles could like go down because I haven't used eye cream in like more than two weeks. The birthday party is at six and I don't want to be rushing or making everybody wait for me. So I'm going to go ahead and clean my lash line because of all the skincare because I don't want it falling off when I'm in public. That's going to be so embarrassing. So that's the lash cluster I'm gonna be using. It's from B&Q Lashes. So I got the one that comes with the bun and the seal and the lash remover. Is it dry? Actually, no, it's not dried. So I'm gonna go with the longest one that's gonna be 16 at the end of my lashes. I usually apply a little to my lash. Ooh, that just went in my eye, Jesus. My vision's blurry. I have to stop blinking. The good thing it doesn't burn though. It went in my eye, but it doesn't burn. Okay, so one eye is done. Look at the difference. So I'm going to go ahead and use the um, seal just so it can last longer. I noticed when I didn't use the seal, it fell off quicker. Like the next day it fell off. So it's just better to use the seal and make it last longer. Okay, here's the finished look. I think I've actually gotten better with doing gloster lashes. This is like my third time doing it. I'm gonna be using this Razorless Shave Cream. It's just easier for me. I just slather it on my skin and just wipe it off and the hair is gone. And I don't have bumps or anything. That's the thing. It says four minutes, but I leave it for like seven minutes and then I wipe it off. So I'm gonna go ahead and start my makeup because it's almost time. We're gonna go there late anyways because with Nigerian parties, if they say they're gonna start at like 6, they're gonna start at like 8 or something. I'm just gonna go ahead and get started. And I was gonna try this makeup technique I saw. It's underpainting. I tried it once before and it didn't go quite well. I don't know why I'm trying it again, but we'll go ahead and try it because it looked so good. So I wanna try it and see how it comes out. I hope it goes well. I'm gonna go with this purse and those shoes. How we I really like how the makeup came out.
my skincare because I just shaved my face and I feel like I'm starting to look like a raccoon. You know, when you shave your face, your face is like one to two shades lighter. So now that I shave my face, my dark circles are starting to show more. I've been really sleep deprived, like it's bad. I'm gonna use a Calvin clay mask today because for some reason, whenever I shave my face, it just feels rough and I have like little bumps. But I try to be careful this time. I washed my face immediately after I shaved my face. I don't see any bumps. This one was here before I shaved my face, but I don't really see any bumps now. So I'm just trying to be cautious because I'm going for a party, right? And I need my makeup to be smooth. That's why I shaved my face in the first place. It needs to be perfect and I don't need any more breakout because I feel like something's wrong with me like whenever i have somewhere important to go and i need my makeup to be on point that's when i have like random breakouts so i'm not trying to take any chances here <laughs> lotion and then oil but i feel like this works better i tried that before this works better for me i feel like my blood's in more moisture for me because my skin is still damp and then i use the body oil it just makes my skin softer and it feels really hydrated for a long time so every single skincare i'm going to be using is going to be like a calming or soothing skincare because i'm just trying to make sure this face doesn't break out i hope it works out well for me my face tends to get really dry when i shave it so i'm going to use i'm I don't know how to say it. This toner really helps to calm breakouts. And I'm gonna go in with another toner. This one's thicker. This one's a hyaluronic acid toner. You can see how it looks. It's like thicker. And I like to use this when my face is still damp. I'm gonna go ahead and use the snail mucin. I really like Cosrx, but it didn't work for me because it kept breaking me out. I'm glad I found this one. This one works well for me. Don't forget your hands too. I usually put the rest of them on my hands. Because they need it too. I have pretty dry hands, so that helps. And then I'm gonna go with my favorite syrup. As you can tell, I'm almost out of the bottle. So I just have to buy another one. Now would be a good time to actually use an eye cream because my dark circles, they're not playing with me. My eye cream just disappeared into thin air. Now I know the eye cream actually works because some people say it doesn't work. I feel like it works for me because even if I don't sleep enough, my, my dark circles, I don't think they've been this bad. So I'm going to have to get another one. I'm going to go in with this moisturizer from Numbers In Number 1. I have a toner that has azulene in it and that really helps with my breakouts. So uh, I hope it helps. It has kind of like a purple color. I don't know if you can tell from the camera. It's kind of like a purple color in there. Okay, so fingers crossed. I hope I don't break out. Please, God, please. I'm just gonna go ahead and get ready for bed and I'll see you guys. something out i'm just gonna find something simple like a pair of jeans and a cute top so i have two options i have this cute crop top and you can tie it at the back i'm not trying to iron my clothes right now or steam the clothes up. i can steam it but i'm trying to save time so i don't think i'm gonna wear that or i can i think i'm gonna wear this one it's just a simple button-up shirt and just put on a cute pair of jeans yeah i'm good to go I'm done with my makeup. Now I'm just gonna go ahead and style my hair. Okay, 
guys, that's my outfit. <laughs> I don't even can see my shoes. I don't trust myself with a shirt, but I'm gonna wear it because it's cute. I don't trust myself with white. I might stain it, but that's fine. I'll risk it because I look good.